hey guys welcome to my channel and in this class we will see mapping of url to the view function so last class we had created view function and here in this class we will map those view function to the url so let's say over here this is our deployment server let's say after this i have a url called playground slash hello so whenever a user enters this url it should be a view function should be called so if I put it right now, it will show me page not found. All right. So if I if a user puts this particular URL, then he should be directed to this view function. So I'll show you what is that. So I'll come to view function inside this. We had written this. Okay. So whenever a user enters that particular URL, hello world should be returned to that user. But how it will be done right now, it is not showing it because we have not mapped the this particular views to the URL. So in this class, we will learn how to map the URL. All right. So now let's go to uh, playground. So we had created an app playground. Okay. Inside that playground, what we will do, we will create a file. We'll write it as urls dot pi because every okay we have already created it so if you have not created i have already created it while practicing so if you have not created then you can create it this is urls dot py okay now every app which is there it is having a his own url all right so for doing that what you uh, what you do you just create a urls dot py and in that what we will do we will import the path function and views function so i'll write from django dot urls import path okay and from dot dot means in this from the same folder you import views okay so i'm importing the path and importing the views and after this what i'll do i'll define a special variable called url patterns so i'll write url pattern equals to bracket okay now you be careful that these are all are in small case so you have to be very careful because django looks for this only all right now here we will define path okay and if you see it takes this path takes a parameter as a route which is a string and followed by a http function that is a views function so i'll write what i'll do i'll simply write playground slash hello and since this is a string so i'll have to keep it in string because it takes parameter as string okay then followed by i'll call the function so i'll call views dot the name of the function and name of the function is say hello okay so now this particular url has been mapped only for the app purpose and now i'll map this particular url to my main function that is storefront so this particular url has to be mapped in the main url which is a urls.py this one under the storefront so come to your storefront directory all right and open urls.py okay now if you see if you see over here this particular line says that uh, if you want include rls pattern or configuration two things you are required to do first is you include a function from the django.urls and second thing is that you add a url to the urls pattern so we will do it one by one so first i'll include import the include function and after that i will what i'll do i'll add a url so i'll write over here playground all right slash hello okay sorry playground and then I'll write include function. Okay. And this will called playground dot urls. Don't worry guys. I'll make you understand what it exactly says. Okay. All right. Now you see here it says that this particular line says that any 
यू आर एल विच इज स्टार्टिंग विथ प्ले ग्राउंड ओके फॉलोड बाई अ फॉरवर्ड स्लैश शुड बी रूटेड टू दी प्ले ग्राउंड ऐप दिस ऐप ओके सो एनी रिक्वेस्ट फ्रॉम ए यूजर इफ इट स्टार्ट विथ प्ले ग्राउंड इफ इट्स यू आर एल स्टार्ट विथ प्ले ग्राउंड इट विल रीडायरेक्ट इट टू दी प्ले ग्राउंड ऐप ऑल राइट सो ओवर हियर इफ यू सी हियर वी हैव रिटर्न प्ले ग्राउंड स्लैश हेलो सो आई नीड नॉट राइट इट प्ले ग्राउंड ओवर हियर अगेन बिकॉज आई हैव मैप्ड इट इन साइड द मेन यू आर एल सो आई सिंपली राइट हेलो स्लैश ओके एंड आई सेव इट सो इट सिंपली सेज एनी यू आर एल स्टार्ट विथ प्ले ग्राउंड फॉलोड बाई फॉरवर्ड स्लैश यू रीडायरेक्ट द थिंग इन टू प्ले ग्राउंड ऐप ऑल राइट एंड दिस इज अ फंक्शन विच वी कॉल्ड बेसिकली इंक्लूड इज अ फंक्शन सो इंक्लूड फंक्शन रिक्वायर्स अ पैरामीटर विच इज अ स्ट्रिंग which we had given it as playground.urls all right so if we send a request to playground slash hello django knows that all requests that starts with playground will be handled by this app so what it gonna do it gonna chop off the first part of the url which we had done it over here we had removed the playground app all right and now if i run this go back to the urls.py playground module we don't need to add this playground so okay so that's what we had done it over here so because we have already added it in our main urls so if we go to the server again now if i go to my web server and then i simply write playground slash hello it should return me hello world all right so it is not doing it because so okay guys here we have to write urls url patterns not patterns so this we have to be careful the starting only i told you but i only made a mistake so you have to be careful here you have to write url as pad url patterns all right save it and then you go to your this thing now when i write slash playground and slash hello it should return me hello world so if i press enter it should return me hello world so you can see here all right so this was all about the mapping of your url to use function all right guys in next class we will see about templates so i see you guys in next class till time you take care bye